No more on the latest update from Turkey. In particular, the medical countermeasures at Indonesian Field Hospital. Joining us now, live TVRI World reporter Zolhafish Tadore. Zolhafish, your report, please. Go ahead. Well, hi, Eda, and I'm currently in Hassa and uh, Hatay province. And yes, I'm at the Field Hospital, Indonesian Field Hospital. Uh, provided by the Indonesian government and to know more on the uh, handling efforts uh, by the uh, Indonesian emergency medical team. I'm currently joined uh, by uh, pediatrician uh, at Indonesian Field Hospital, Dr. Dimastri Anantio. Dr. Dimas, thank you very much for being with us uh, today on TVRI World. Dr. Dimas, what kind of resources are uh, immediately available to the uh, rest you teamed um, on the ground following the earthquake okay because Indonesia uh, Indonesian medical team uh, from Indonesia prepare for a type 2 of uh, Indonesia uh, emergency medical team we have uh, resources from uh, clinical type uh, mobile clinical type and fixed mobile uh, fixed cl clinical uh, type and also operation and also what the doctor that uh, sent here uh, 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 is kind of uh, uh, the medical doctor and also pediatrician uh, uh, and also uh, surgeon and also orthopedic uh, and also obstetric and gynecologist. Yes. As a, as a pediatrician uh, doctor, how, how many uh, children have been uh, uh, treated uh, at the field hospital approximately? Okay, uh, until this day, approximately in uh, clinical uh, emergency medical team here in Indonesia medical Indonesia emergency medical team, uh, approximately we serve uh, 700 uh, people here. Yeah. And approximately half uh, from uh, 700 uh, uh, patients who uh, get here is children. Uh, so approximately 300 children uh, we serve here. Well, doctor, so most of the patients are children. And um, how are the medical team and, and resources coordinated uh, 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 with the uh, rescue efforts? Okay. Every day uh, we do internal coordination at uh, 8 uh, o'clock in the morning, uh, Turkey time. And also we do the debriefing uh, internal coordination at 9 uh, at the night uh, to make sure uh, the coordination in uh, our team. Right, Doctor. Can you give us an, uh, a specific update about the um, uh, data? Uh, what kind of injuries did the medical team uh, primarily treat uh, in the field hospital, Doctor? Yes, because uh, approximately this day is uh, more than one week after earthquake. So uh, the, uh, we, we, uh, uh, the injury problem, the injury case is uh, uh, solved. Uh, uh, we, we, we don't get the injury problem in uh, this week. So uh, the, the, the problem that we uh, serve uh, is some kind uh, uh, like diarrhea and also coughing and also uh, rhinorrhea and also, uh, and also uh, fever because uh, they, live in, uh, they live together in one place. So the transmitted and also disease is easily to spread uh, to the people, children and also adults, yes. Right, Doctor. How about uh, the, the mental issues uh, or mental health provided by the, uh, the medical team here to those who are affected following uh, the earthquake that rampaged uh, Turkey on, uh, on, on February the 6th? Yeah, we prepare the mental issues or uh, the health uh, health mental issues uh, in the in uh, in this place uh, by prepare with um, uh, our team that uh, consolidate with uh, psychiatrists and uh, and also psych psychologists 
uh, uh, and now we we have uh, one place, a clinical place, uh, to serve the uh, health and mental issues. Uh, uh, if there are uh, any patient with uh, have some kind of a problem with uh, mental uh, with a mental uh, health issues, uh, some kind uh, like. Uh, depression uh, uh, and and also uh, psychosomatics and etc yes doctor uh, let's talk about the um, challenges that have been facing by the um, medical team or emergency medical team workers here in the field is there any particular challenges that have been facing by the medical team yeah actually uh, we are uh, all of the team is from Indonesia and Indonesia is a tropical uh, country the tropical country with a warm uh, warm condition and also temperature uh, it's very different with here uh, in the night approximately the temperature is a minus three yeah so we supposed to be uh, adapt, uh, adaptation with uh, this condition with with this temperature and uh, with this condition this extreme condition uh, uh, and thanks God uh, all of the team is on health condition now yes true I mean I'm totally agree with that doctor uh, even if now Edda uh, the uh, today is a little bit sunny but it's also freezing all at once because now the temperatures there is around um, 13 to 15 uh, Celsius degrees and it's yeah this is ice mountain yes then and then in the back of, uh, of us it, there's a uh, ice mountain and uh, doctor and uh, this uh, brings to my next question uh, uh, what kind of follow-up uh, care that are being uh, that being uh, carried out so far yeah uh, okay from the case that we uh, serve and uh, uh, especially the operation patient uh, after operation patient post operation patient we also do the home care uh, facilities uh, for uh, from our uh, from our team go to the uh, house of the patient uh, to make sure uh, the condition after uh, operation post operation uh, and then uh, yeah also the psychosocial team also uh, do the project there on the house of the uh, people in here right doctor is there i'm wondering about is there any particular or any specific um, treatment to provide uh, for those uh, uh, vulnerable groups uh, such as children or elderly uh, following the earthquake doctor yeah okay uh, from the fixed clinical facilities here, the uh, the yeah, the children and also uh, 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 adult uh, yeah uh, the yeah the elderly, uh, we give a priority uh, to uh, make sure the health uh, serve uh, the health service uh, is uh, the the. Uh, uh, the they more uh, uh, priority to uh, to give uh, uh, serve so uh, the children and also elderly people uh, can uh, solve can serve uh, f uh, uh, more uh, 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 more uh, more priority than uh, just only ordinary or adult people. Well, doctor, and 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 how about the how does the the medical team work with other uh, related agencies or organizations uh, uh, in the field? Because uh, all uh, all of the workers are in the nations. Is can you please uh, tell us a bit uh, uh, stories uh, or 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 uh, uh, unique stories that have been uh, facing in the field? Yeah. Uh, approximately uh, every three days. Uh, our medical team, uh, <coughs> our representative medical team, <coughs> uh, do the coordination with the regional uh, health, uh, health association here. Um, uh, the health association here uh, uh, 
uh, also uh, invite another uh, NGO here, uh, so they they can uh, make sure where where the place that uh, is uh, possibly to give uh, more concern there. So uh, from here we we know that. Uh, the emergency medical team from Belgium and also emergency medical team from uh, USA also give a profit and service here. So uh, uh, from this place, we also learn a lot of things here to make a uh, 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 lot of uh, preparation uh, 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 will be good in the future. <coughs> Doctor, this might be my last question, Doctor. As you mentioned earlier about the lessons learned that uh, all medical uh, team workers uh, learned uh, during the operations in the field, what lessons learned actually that could be applied to future disasters? Probably in the, I mean, that could be prevent. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we learn a lot of uh, things from here. Uh, if we, if uh, Indonesian emergency medical team will uh, send the team <coughs> uh, to uh, the target country, uh, that uh, uh, maybe in not in other condition on other <coughs> uh, temperature, uh, we we supposed to be prepared. Uh, we supposed to be prepare a uh, lot of uh, logistic and also a lot of a uh, lot of uh, the simple thing like uh, the capabilities of ten and uh, and then also the heater and also uh, uh, and also the water heater and etc. To make sure the medical team can uh, can be survive and also give the uh, good and optimal uh, service yeah because uh, in uh, in the extreme or a different condition uh, from Indonesia uh, the medical team supposed to be adapt uh, uh, adaptation first uh, to uh, give the uh, optimal service for the patient. So we 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 uh, we learn a lot of things here. <coughs> Doctor Dimas, thank you very much. We truly appreciate your time. Please stay safe, Doctor. Yeah, yeah. And Edda, that concludes my report to NN. And um, in the meantime, I'm Zul Hafiz Kador and our camera person Danu Dirja reporting live for Focus Today TVRI World. Back to you now, Edda. Thank you, Zul Hafiz and Danu, and also Dr. Dimas for reporting about the aftermath in Turkey.